hi friends welcome back to the channel so in this video i will show you a step by step process how to install windows 10 and in this process you need a minimum 8 gb of usb pen drive so without wasting your time let's start the process so first we need to create a bootable usb pen drive of windows 10 so for this open your browser and in the browser type windows 10 and you can see the Microsoft URL click on the URL so this is the official website of Microsoft scroll down and you can see this option create Windows 10 installation media click on this download tool now option so this is the tool media creation tool just click on it to run this software now wait for a few seconds so the process has been started wait for a few seconds it will take some time now click on this accept option this process will take some time so you have to wait patiently now select the second option create installation media select this option then click on next now here you can see the option the download option untick this option and you can see the first option language so you can change or select your language addition is windows 10 and you can also select the operating system bit so i will go for 64 bit then click on next now select the first option usb flash drive and one more important thing it needs to be at least 8 gb of space in your pen drive so this is important and if you want to download windows 10 iso image select the second option so this option will help you to download windows 10 iso image so in my case i will go for the first one select this usb flash drive option and now insert your pen drive so i plugged in my pen drive in my laptop as you can see this is my usb pen drive I will show you so as you can see this is my USB pen drive of 8 GB you can see the space as well so one more important thing in this process all the data in your pen drive will be removed so this is important if you have any important data in your USB pen drive take the data backup first now after plug in your pen drive select this option and then click on next so this is my USB pen drive will show you again as you can see this is the drive letter F and this is my USB pen drive same here you can see drive letter F this is my USB pen drive select your USB pen drive then click on next so this process will create a bootable pen drive of Windows 10 and the process has been started and it will take some time so I will fast forward this video process completed your USB flash drive is ready now click on finish now unplug your pen drive safely so the bootable pen drive is ready now now install Windows 10 so this is my Windows 10 bootable pen drive and this is my laptop plug in your USB pen drive now open the boot menu in your laptop so I'm using an HP laptop in HP laptop you can use this F9 key to open your boot menu I will show you how to do it turn on your laptop and within a second start pressing F9 key I will show you and start pressing this F9 key continuously to open the boot menu and you can see the boot menu now select this SanDisk so there are two options you can see UEFI SanDisk and this legacy SanDisk so you have to choose one of them I will go for UEFI SanDisk this is my pen drive name select your pen drive then press enter now wait for a few seconds it will start booting from your 
USB pen drive of Windows 10. And this is the installation menu. So now click on next. Now click on install now. And now skip this option. Click on this. Now select your edition. So I will go for Windows 10 Pro edition. Then click on next. Take this option. I accept the license term. Then click on next. Now click on this custom option, the second option. So this is my hard drive. I have 120 GB of SSD in my laptop. So first I will select this unallocated space. Then click on new to create a partition. Now enter the amount of partition you want to create. So I will go for the single partition. Click on apply and click on OK. So the partition has been created. Click on next to install Windows 10. And you can see the process has been started and it will take around half an hour. So the installation is almost complete. Now select your region, your country. Then click on yes. Now select your keyboard layout, then click on yes. You can skip this option. And now you have two setup options. I will go for the personal use. Click on next. Now you have two options to log in. You can use your Microsoft account to log in or you can create a new Microsoft account or you can create an offline account. So I will go for the offline account. Click on this option offline account. Then click on this limited experience. Now enter a name to create a new login account. So I will use tech. Then click on next. Now set a password. Then click on next. Confirm the password again. Then click on next. Now enter the security question. So I will choose a random question. Then click on next. You can type the actual city. Then click on next. Now click on accept or you can edit that option location you can turn off the location you can turn off this option as well it's up to you click on accept now skip this option now click on accept or you can disable this option as well so i will go for not right now So the installation has been done now. So this is how you can install Windows 10. This is all for the video. Thank you. Thanks for watching TechWhite. Have a nice day.